Okay. How do you think about marriage? Is it an action item in your life list, or you just leave it to destiny? Let's see some statistics first. This is the percentage of marital status of the population in Taiwan from 2006 to 2014. From this diagram, you can see the, um, the percentage of married population is decreasing, and the per percentage of the unmarried population and divorced population is increasing. This diagram tells us that pe more people don't get married recently. The second diagram shows the married population by age in Taiwan in the same, from the same, at the same period. The lowest one is from 20 to 24 years old, and the other one is from 35 to 39 years old. From this diagram, we can see the percentage of married people in young age is decreasing and the percentage of married population in elder age is increasing. This diagram tells us that people get married less. Why don't, why don't people get married or why do they get married less? According to some research, the major reason is that people don't find a suitable one, suitable partner, or they, don't, they, want, they still want to preserve their individual freedom. Because marriage means you have to compromise with, with your partner in some issues and let the code of marriage. But what's the benefit of marriage? According to some research, there are two kinds of benefit: physical benefit and mental benefit. According to New York University or University's Langham Medical <coughs> Center, married people had a 5% lower chance to get Cardiovascular disease, and they will have more, and they will have fewer uh, symptoms of depression and higher self acting compared to married people, because marriage will give you emotional, financial, and intramural support, and they will also increase the physical and intellectual intimacy. So they will decrease the blood blood pressure and increase your heart health. However. Some research also find that people in bad marriage will, are actually more likely to experience negative cardio, cardiovascular <coughs> effect compared to people in good marriages or single people. This tells us that the quality of marriage is really important. To sum up this research, we can know the happiness in, of different status are, is that in a good marriage, it's better than to stay single. But to stay single is better than in a bad marriage. But if you are married and unfortunately you are in bad marriage, how should you do? How should you divorce? Divorce. <laughs> yeah, divorce is the one is the one of the solution. If you want to increase your relationship from bad marriage to a good marriage, you have another curve. You have another choice. You can learn this curve. This course will teach you how to resolve the conflict between you and your partner. And this course will teach you how to recover the relationship after a big crisis or a big conflict. On the other hand, this course will teach you how to increase the intimacy with your partner. This course will teach you how to love your partner in his or her way, not your way and how to guide your partner to love you in your way, not his or her way. Listening is love. Empathy is healing. The best way to show your love to your, <coughs> to your partner is to listen to him or her. And to emphasize his or her feeling is the best way to hear his heart or her heart. Okay, and for the single people, if you are single, no matter you are happy or unhappy, and you want to have a relationship, Especially a good relationship. How should you do? You have another curse. <laughs> this is a really love curse. In this curse, we will teach. In this curse, this curse will teach you the nature of the love, and this curse will teach you how to find the right one. Because finding the right one is much, is much, is more, is more important than doing any effort in a relationship. This curse will teach you how to find the right one and how to let yourself be the right one. Okay, for the curse information, this curse is <laughs> every, social, every, social, 
night from uh, from nine seven thirty to ten ten to ten o'clock. And the learning curve learning love curve is ongoing and it it will end it on next year, April twenty one. And the journey to intermercy it began on next year, May five to September twenty two. The classroom is near Gongguan station. Yes, and the and the fee. You were you were curious about the fee. The curve each time is value five hundred five hundred ninety dollar. But now I give you ninety percent discount. <laughs> 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 you feel behind, right? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.